just arrived in Westminster. Can you see the big old Ben behind me? It was going on a boat tour today. Lost hope. You see him? So we're gonna get down somewhere down here. Oh look, we're gonna miss that one. Hi Hope. Hi. Welcome. Oh, look, that's it. I know, I think we're gonna miss that one. I think we need to get in the queue down there. We're going, we're going, we're going on the boat. Westminster PR. Thank you Debbie for another amazing gift that we've got. Look at how late we've left it. What's the date today? 26th of June. It's the 25th today. We had two days left. We kept banking on, oh it might be sunnier. We might have better weather. And it's okay today. The ticket was bought a year ago. <laughs> yeah, it was for my birthday. Hello. How do you know his name? From the Good Dinosaur. Have you seen that? How do you know his name then? So I watch YouTube videos of little kids. Thank you. Have you ever been on a boat on the Thames? Yeah. For my birthday a few years ago, my dad had a friend who had a speedboat and he took me along the Thames and that was like before there were speed limits or something along the Thames and we went bombing it, absolutely bombing it but apparently now you are you have to go quite a lot slower It's really nice being on a boat with a lot of tourists because we can pull out the camera and not feel like we're complete losers because everybody's taking selfies with a selfie stick yeah, but I'm just talking to you. Nobody else can tell. Hi, let's get a snack for our holiday scrapbook. Now, when the trains go above that bridge, it does become very noisy. And that's why the building to the right is soundproof. And there we have the Royal Festival Hall, Cleopatra's Needle, made in Egypt three and a half thousand years ago. There's over 550 steps. If you look carefully, you can see there are people up there today. They probably started their journey yesterday, but yeah, they're there now. The bridge was opened on a Saturday morning in the millennium year by the Queen. And it was closed the same afternoon by the police. <laughs> Years ago, the bridge would have opened a minimum of a hundred times every single week. Nowadays, we'd be lucky to see it lift maybe five or six times a week. I don't know if you can tell, but I've got a big hay fever. I've just got to wash my face. How do you feel? Feeling a bit better, a bit better, but it's still really some of you may recognise this scene of London from the movie. It was to the right where Bill Sykes fell from the warehouse rooftops and also where Fagan dropped all the gold and silver into the mud at the end of the film. Bermondsey years ago was a very poor, very rough part of London. It was an ideal setting for Oliver Twist. The architect who designed these buildings said when you look at them, you're supposed to be able to see French soldiers marching along. Well, I don't know what medication he was on at the time when he made that statement, but honestly, that is what they're meant to be. When Cher lived in this building, she wrote letters to our company and she complained about us telling you where she lived. Seriously, eventually Cher got so fed up that she moved further down the river. And I will point it out when we go past. <laughs> Just coming up to Greenwich now, I might pop out and see what's going on around those parts. We're sitting down for a performance of something. It looks like piratey, steampunk. cup of water from Greg's. Now he's using his sunglasses arm to 
you stir the soup. But I bought a drink as well. No, you didn't. You got a drink free. Hope bought her lunch. <laughs> Greenwich and Docklands International Festival. So check that out. Why? It'll be dumb. Yeah. <laughs> I think we've vlogged in Greenwich before. We both really love it. It's like a really kind of villagey type feel. There's this really amazing park. We actually came here last year before my birthday before we went to Paris. And there's a really big hill if you kind of climb all the way up that overlooks the whole of London and it looks really beautiful. Um, I'd love to live here. We both said we'd love to live here. And I've lived at places and they're not very, like they're in our budget. Um, but Greenwich can be a little bit of a faff to like get around. It's kind of can be like an hour out. Would have taken us an hour to travel there today if we hadn't have got the boat. And you're not allowed to cycle through that underground tunnel under the Thames. So you have to walk your bike. So don't cycle to Greenwich. Get a tube. Get an Uber. See that's the kind of thing that you should say when we're talking about where we should live. Because if you can't cycle to the city, you'd hate to live here. That's why I don't want to be here. No, he had no idea that he thought of that until you probably saw his face. Let's replay that. The moment that Adam realises Oh yeah, she's right. Never thought of that. You're a numbskull. Well, we decided to come back up because it stopped, stopped raining. That's the HMS something. Belfast? Is it? Yeah. Look at Tower Bridge, it looks so like epic. That ship has actually been on Don't Tell the Bride before. Someone got married on that. Really? On Don't Tell the Bride. Yeah. Yeah. That's the Union Jack. No, it's not. Flippin' heck, Adam does not listen to anyone. What did he say about the Union flag? Well, the Union Jack flag. It has to be on the top of a special crown, on, on a crown thing. <sighs> right, this is the HMS Belfast, and on the front, you see that flag? That's the Union Jack flag. Adam, you've got to be listening to this. That's the Union Jack flag because the only reason it makes it a Union Jack flag is firstly it has to have like the little crown on top and secondly unless it's on a on one of Her Majesty the Queen's Na Royal Navy ships oh it's God. not a Union Jack it's just a Union flag so that's the only one in London Cheers Happy graduation. You can go jumble with your name. Oh what? Oh yeah. That's cool. Are you on that? Give that hat a little toss. Will it come off? Is it attached to your head? Go on, give it one. Give it a quick one. Alright, get a photo of that then.